Hello students, this is Dr. Anita Raj, your chemistry mentor, welcoming you for an important session in aldehydes, ketones and carboxylic acids. In this session, we shall see the different types of chemical properties of benzaldehyde. Okay? So, under the chemical properties of benzaldehyde is the nucleophilic addi addition reaction. See, under nucleophilic addition reaction, we have the reaction with HCN. Okay? So, let us see what happens uh, during the reaction with HCN. See, this benzaldehyde undergoes nucleophilic addition reaction with HCN to give benzaldehyde cyanohydrin first. And this benzaldehyde cyanohydrin, this undergoes hydrolysis and it produces mantelic acid. Okay. Shall see what is happening here. So, this is benzaldehyde. Okay. CHO and this is hydrogen cyanide. So, what happens here is, see during this reaction, this H gets added up to this O and this CN gets added up to this carbon okay so we get benzaldehyde cyanohydrin first okay so let me write the benzaldehyde cyanohydrin product carbon h oh and this cn gets added up here okay and now this undergoes hydrolysis okay h plus water okay so what happens here the cn which is get, which is attached to the carbon will be getting converted to COH okay so here OH H the CN gets converted to COH on hydrolysis okay so this is called as a mandelic acid okay so this is an important reaction so mandelic acid understood students so the next reaction is a reaction with a sodium bisulfate what happens with sodium bisulfate? It benzaldehyde undergoes nucleophilic addition reaction with sodium bisulfate to give sodium so benzaldehyde bisulfite compound. Okay. So let us see how this reaction takes place. See here, this hydrogen gets added up to this O and the rest of the part that is NaSO3 gets added up to this carbon. Okay. So uh, let me show how this happens. This gets added up to this and this rest of the product NaSO3 will be getting added up to this carbon. Okay. So this is what happening. So let me write the product now. Okay. Benzene ring. Carbon. Here we have H. So, this hydrogen gets added up to this OH and the rest is Na, SO3, Na, is it not? SO3, Na. So, this is the product, okay. So, this is benzaldehyde sodium bisulfate. Understood students? Next is the reaction with ammonia and its derivatives, okay. So, the first reaction is reaction with ammonia. So, what happens when benzaldehyde reacts with ammonia? Benzaldehyde undergoes reaction with ammonia to give hydrobenzamide. It undergoes reaction with ammonia to give hydrobenzamide. Actually, here we have three molecules of benzaldehyde and two molecules of ammonia. Okay. So, what happens here? Two, see here hydrogen, three hydrogen atoms are there. So, two into three, six hydrogen atoms. So, six hydrogen atoms combines with this six hydrogen atoms combines with three oxygen atoms to form water molecule. Okay. So, the rest we should combine and write. Okay. So, let me show how this happens. See this O combines with this hydrogen. Okay. So, here we are having three molecules of oxygen and six molecules of hydrogen. So, how many water molecules are getting? Uh, uh, are coming out now three water molecules is not three h2o it's released okay so the rest will be writing c6 h5 ch close the bracket three times n2 is it not three times n2 is it not so how this is c6 h5 ch this is c6 h5 this is ch so, 3 times we are having. So, C6H5CH3 times and 2N. Is it not? So, N2. So, this is this is called hydrobenzamide. This, the product name is hydro, hydrobenzamide. Understood students? Okay. So, the next reaction is a reaction with hydroxyl amine and phenyl hydrazin. Both the reactions I have given in the same uh, thing. Okay. So, what happens when the benzaldehyde is undergoing reaction with hydroxylamine? Benzaldehyde undergoes condensation reaction with hydroxylamine to give benzaldoxime and with phenylhydrazine, with phenylhydrazine, this benzaldehyde gives benzaldehyde phenylhydrazone. So, two reactions. First, let us see how what happens with hydroxylamine. 
so this is benzaldehyde this is hydroxylamine so what happens this forms a benzol doxine is it not this forms a benzol doxine okay so let me write and show you what happens here this hydrogen this oxygen combines with this two hydrogen atoms okay so water molecule is removed h2o is removed you write the rest of the product now okay ch what's what's the thing left out double bond here we have one n and oh is it not so that we should write n o h understood students so this is benzol doxine benzol doxine understood okay so this is what happening with hydroxylamine so what happens next with the phenyl hydrazine so this is phenyl hydrazine what is hydrazine actually hydrazine nh2 nh2 so here instead of one hydrogen there is one phenyl group okay so that is called this is called as phenyl hydrazine now benzyl benzaldehyde reacts with phenyl hydrazine and let us see what hap what's happening the same molecule water molecule is removed this oxygen combines with two hydrogen okay and a water molecule and a water molecule is removed okay h2o plus you write the rest of the product benzene ring we have ch is it not then double bond write the rest of the thing n n h c6h5 that is all okay so what's the name of this compound it is benzaldehyde benzaldehyde phenyl hydrazone the name of this compound is benzaldehyde phenyl hydrazone okay benzaldehyde phenyl hydrazone understood students so the next reaction is with reaction with pcl5 so what happens see benzaldehyde undergoes reaction with pcl5 to give benzol chloride okay it combines with pcl5 to form benzol chloride how this reaction takes place see this pcl5 for your uh, uh, understanding i am writing like this i am splitting this as cl2 and pcl3 okay so this pcl5 is getting uh, split to pcl3 plus cl2 okay so what happens now see here this cl2 combines with this okay the cl2 combines with this carbon okay and this oxygen gets added up here so what's the product now c6 h5 ch cl2 plus po cl3 so this is the product what's the name of this compound it is benzal benzal okay benzal chloride understood students this is benzal chloride so the next reaction is with sodium hydroxide that is canizero reaction this is a very important naming reaction canizero reaction what is happening here see so this benzaldehyde reacts with concentrated sodium hydroxide to form a mixture of benzyl alcohol and salt of benzoic acid so it forms a mixture of benzyl alcohol okay it forms a mixture of benzyl alcohol and a salt of benzoic acid understood students so let us see what's happening here so this is benzaldehyde and it is combining with sodium hydroxide okay and it is producing benzyl alcohol what is benzyl alcohol c6h5 ch2oh okay plus what is a benzoic acid c6h5 c o o h is it not this is benzoic acid so instead of one hydrogen if you are having sodium then it is called a sodium salt of benz benzoic acid or sodium benzoate so this is sodium benzoate sodium benzoate or sodium salt of benzoic acid this one is benzyl benzyl alcohol understood students so, so the next important reaction is benzoin condensation okay benzoin condensation what is happening here in benzoin condensation see this benzaldehyde when heated with an alcoholic solution of potassium cyanide undergoes self condensation to form benzoin understood see this benzaldehyde two molecules of benzaldehyde we have taken this when heated with an alcoholic solution of potassium cyanide undergoes self condensation to form benzoin okay so here let us write what is the uh, taken here alcoholic k 
KC and potassium cyanide is it not when it is heated so it is uh, heating we are heating these two molecules of benzaldehyde so what happens here see this hydrogen this hydrogen gets added up to this oxygen and this gets added up to this carbon okay just an add up just you write so what is the product we are getting C6 H5 C OH is it not and here to this carbon what is getting added CH okay this hydrogen will be uh, this already we are having a hydrogen here so CH single bond C double bond O is it not double bond O C6H5 understood so this is what what's the name of this compound this is a benzoin okay that's an important reaction understood benzoin con condensation so this uh, benzyl two molecules of benzyl here undergo self condensation in the presence of alcoholic solution of potassium cyanide we get benzoin understood now the next uh, reaction is perkins reaction so what's happening in perkins reaction let us see see here benzyl here when heated with an aliphatic acid anhydride see this is aliphatic acid anhydride that is acetic anhydride in the presence of sodium salt of the acid so sodium salt of the same acid what is the acid here acetic acid so now sodium salt of the same acid means uh, sodium acetate corresponding to the anhydride means corresponding to this anhydride condensation takes place and we get alpha beta and saturated acid understood so let me read once again benzaldehyde when heated with an aliphatic acid anhydride in the presence of sodium salt of acid corresponding to the anhydride condensation takes place and an alpha beta unsaturated acid is obtained okay so now here benzaldehyde when heated uh, with acetic anhydride in the presence of sodium acetate we get cinnamic acid okay we get cinnamic acid so let me write the product now cinnamic acid c6h5 single bond ch double bond ch single bond cooh so this is cinnamic acid plus acetic acid we will be getting acetic acid also ch3 cooh okay so this is a cinnamic acid okay so this is also a very important reaction understood students so the next important reaction is oxidation reaction see this benzoyl reaction undergoes oxidation in the presence of uh, dilute nitric acid it produces uh, uh, benzoic acid always aldehyde group will be getting converted to acid acidic group in the pres uh, uh, undergoing oxidation okay so what's the product here c6h5 COOH okay so this is a benzoic acid this uh, compound is called as benzoic acid see this is very important okay benzoic uh, acid now under what is happening during reduction reaction see benzaldehyde in the presence of lithium aluminum hydride it undergoes reduction to form benzyl alcohol see always this ald this aldehyde group okay always this aldehyde group will be getting converted to an alcoholic group undergoing while it's undergoing reduction reaction okay so uh, let me write the product now c6 h5 ch2 oh okay so this is a benzyl alcohol benzyl alcohol this is also important reaction understood students so the next important reactions are the electrophilic substitution reactions that are taking place in benzaldehyde so the first one is halogenation see benzaldehyde undergoes halogenation with considerable difficulty because side chain halogenation occurs fast okay so here normally the halogenation of benzaldehyde is a, a tough reaction because uh, uh, instead of uh, undergoing the normal uh, halogenation reaction this undergoes a side chain reaction faster okay now uh, let us see what is happening here this undergoes uh, chlorination in the presence of uh, uh, anhydric, uh, anhydrous aluminum chloride okay anhydrous aluminum chloride and we are getting the product like benzoyl chloride okay benzoyl chloride c double bond o here we are having cl okay what happening what's happening here we are having cl two cl molecule two cl atoms is it not so instead of one hydrogen this hydrogen gets added up to this and this chlorine gets added up to this one that's what happening okay so we are getting hcl here so what's the name of this compound it is benzoyl 
benzoyl chloride understood so on halogenation or in chlorination in the presence of anhydrous aluminum chloride we are getting benzoyl chloride so what's happening during nitration so during nitration this benzaldehyde reacts with concentrated nitric acid in the presence of concentrated sulfuric acid we get meta nitrobenzaldehyde we get meta nitrobenzaldehyde okay so the no2 group gets added up to the meta position okay why it meta position because this uh, cho is meta directing okay meta uh, meta nitrobenzaldehyde plus water molecule so this is in the meta position so meta nitrobenzaldehyde okay next one is a sulfonation what's happening during sulfonation this benzaldehyde when it is heated in the presence of sulfuric acid we get meta benzene sulfonic acid we get meta benzene sulfonic acid see here again cho in the meta position okay so uh, sorry so 3 h okay meta benzene sulfonic acid plus water understood so this is these are the different types of uh, reactions uh, we are having under the chemical properties of benzaldehyde okay students uh, fine students you might have understood what i have taught today let me meet you with another important topic in my next video until then it's dr anitara signing off from you thanks for watching